Hello, I'm Dr. Gerald Chodak and this is ProstateVideos.com. In this video, I want to talk about a recent study that used salvage cryotherapy for men that had recurrent disease after getting external radiation or previous cryotherapy. The author is from a recent study, report on over 300 men that went through this treatment. And they have 10-year results that show that about 35% of the men have not recurred after undergoing this form of therapy. The authors conclude that salvage cryotherapy is a good option for men with recurrent disease. Unfortunately, this type of study design does not permit us to really know whether or not a lot of men are being helped. Some of the factors that help determine who might need therapy include the PSA doubling time and how long it took for the PSA to rise after a patient had external radiation or cryotherapy. We know that many of the men, despite having a rising PSA, will not get into trouble. Just because the PSA rises doesn't mean they'll end up dying of the disease or developing metastatic disease. And so a lot of the men may not need to be treated if they are in the favorable group. On the other hand, those men with a rapid PSA doubling time and those who recur soon, relatively soon, after having their primary treatment are probably not going to get a good benefit because most likely their cancer cells have already spread to other parts of the body. So doing something to the prostate in the face of cancer that has already spread probably also won't make a difference. I think that if you are faced with the problem of a recurrence after having either external radiation or cryotherapy, you need to carefully discuss with your doctor the pros and cons of the various treatments. Be prepared to ask them important questions like, how many men in my situation are likely to benefit from this therapy? How many will get side effects? Remember that the longer it took for your PSA to go up and the slower it goes up, the less dangerous it is for you. And so you want to be careful that you don't get a treatment that you didn't need or that you get a treatment that's not going to help you. I hope you find this information helpful. Thank you for watching.